What's up, this is Jake with Hike 734, hiking the Signet Lakes Trail in Yellowstone National Park. And the trail is found along the Norris Canyon Road between Norris and Canyon. And it's a little over four miles one way, so round trip, it's an out and back. So it'd be a little over eight miles. And uh, you start at a pretty obvious trailhead sign and uh, start walking through some, a little bit older stand of lodgepole. And then of course, because of all the fires, it's a younger stand for a while and then you, start to get to where there's a bunch of these little pocket ponds. And one thing to note that with pocket ponds, especially in the springtime and probably in the summer, is bugs, lots of mosquitoes. So bring mosquito spray, bug net, something like that. And um, some of them are a little bit further off. I decided to, curiosity, check this guy out. So it's kind of a bigger pond with a little bit of a meadow. And I just like doing that because you just never know what you're gonna see. And uh, so, but the trail continues on and it comes to this more recently burned area. And of course, if you're watching this video a couple years after I shoot this, then, you know, it might not be so moonscapish, but it just kind of shows, I mean, each stand you get to just shows different, shows how dynamic it is and what with the fires, how it really shapes the area. But anyways, really cool volcanic rock along the way and you know, definitely some birds and that sort of thing. And after the moonscape area, it starts to get back into that alternating between, you know, younger stands and older stands of lodgepole. And then finally you start to get over and it gets to this little tunnel of new lodgepole and then pops you right out into this really sweet meadow that has signet lakes. And signet lakes are really cool, but you really can't get you literally close to them. Um, the trail actually officially ends at one end of the meadow and you can walk along the edge of the meadow, which is what I did, and you can walk all the way pretty close to the lakes, but it is definitely really marshy, at least, you know, kind of this June time frame. So I could only get so close. But the cool thing is Signet is a baby swan. And I got to see a couple of swans, which was awesome. And uh, just a little bit more waterfowl, which I always love. And so, yeah, I mean, it's overall, it's a pretty level hike. There's not a lot of, you know, crazy elevation gain or anything like that. Um, it's kind of a fair trail, I think, overall. You know, the, the Signet Lakes are pretty cool. The trail is nice. Um, I think in the summer it would be pretty brutal, brutally hot because there's not a lot of cover. Um, so I think it's, you know, one of those, it's a neat trail to hike. It wouldn't be my first trail if I was, you know, ranking all this, but um, it's a nice hike. So anyways, if you're looking for a nice, pretty level stroll, it's about eight-ish miles and uh, you want to go to a lake where you might see some waterfowl and maybe even see some other wildlife, um, the Signet Lakes Trail might be for you. So anyways, this is Jake with Hike 734, hiking the Signet Lakes Trail in Yellowstone National Park. If you like this video, subscribe on YouTube and head over to hike734.com for more goodness.